All right, all right, all right, man. <laughs> man, these past few weeks have been a trip. Well, not even last week, but these past few days, man. Yeah, man, sheesh. Talk about being resilient, man. Sorry about the water. But yeah, man, I've, been, I've had a past, I had some crazy few days. Not in a bad way, of course. It's been cool. But just everything going on has been a experience. <laughs> um, I wanted this to be the first video I make for my high podcast, but I'm, I'm not. I'm going to give y'all a brief summary. Tomorrow I get my money. So I'm going to roll some blunts up, smoking, and give y'all a story, man. <coughs> It's funny. It's funny as hell. The way I describe it when high is going to make you funny as shit. It's going to be funny as shit. I'll, <laughs> I'll probably end up getting my, my friend because I, I had met him last week and now we're like best friends, man. Like, I'll do anything for him. And he'll do anything for me. Not anything crazy or anything like that. But, you know, whatever's needed, I got him. You know what I'm saying? Like, um, you know, I've been getting paid money, but my money's been locked in my car. <coughs> so... You know, he's been paying for, like, the motels and stuff like that. So I got to pay him tomorrow the uh, money back. And also, um, I met his wife and his kids, too. <laughs> I met his wife and his kids. A good, they have a good family. He has a great family, man. The kids are amazing, too. But um, I'm about to shave. I'm going to shave tonight so it can be, like, a kind of like a rebirth. You know what I'm saying? I just need to feel different. <clears throat> but it's been crazy, man. These these two guys that we work with, meth heads, uh, we found out that they're gay lovers too, which is a story I'm gonna tell y'all. Just been working a lot. I worked last week. <coughs> I've been coughing a lot from, from smoking. But last week, man, I'm um, these guys, man. It is so funny. The story is so funny. It is so funny. It is so I want to tell it so bad, but I'm going to just wait. I'm going to just wait. Now, I was talking to Shay Mind King, man. He was like, you need to get on SR. But he said, I'll give you some, some leeway because you're young. And I know I got. I need to get on semen retention. So I think I, what I'm going to just do is I'm going to just do semen retention until, I, uh, until something happens. You know. But right now, I just use all my energy for work. You know, I'm working. It's on eight days straight of 10 hours, bro eight, 10 hour days. <laughs> I got three more and then uh, I'm not sure if I want to go back back home and get in my apartment and rest or if I want to just chill out here. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. Um, probably just stay out. I don't know. I don't know, man, because I've been out here. It's going to be like a week and some change that I've been out here because I've been out here since Wednesday, but I'm so resilient. So it's like I do what I got to do. You know what I'm saying? And I'll probably just stay out here, you know, help him, his family, because he's been helping me, you know, whatever they need money-wise. <coughs> or just an extra hand, extra helping hand, man. You know, I met so many great people out here. You know, I really did. I met another friend, you know what I'm saying? And I got another friend who's going through it right now. If you're watching this, you know what I'm saying? He's going through a lot, you know, issues with his, uh, his uh, partner, you know his lady partner and i'm just encouraging him man look if you come to south dakota bro i'll do everything i can to help because people have been doing everything they can to help me so i reciprocate you know what i mean you know any so i don't know if i gotta buy this motherfucker a greyhound ticket <laughs> or send him some information to get started or what <coughs> but we'll figure it out you know what i'm saying but i've been having a good time you know i gotta buy some more pants because uh, it gets cold weirdly. I gotta buy some more shorts. Today, me and my friend about to go wash the clothes for him and his kids and his wife. And we're cooking cooking food outside. And I gotta shave, man. And plus, I'm gonna start working out tomorrow because I ain't trying to get back to being 400 pounds. I lost all this weight and I ain't about to freaking stop. <laughs>